So the question is whether CaCO3, that's calcium carbonate, is soluble or insoluble in water. The short answer is that it's insoluble. It won't dissolve or dissociate into its ions when you put it in water. There's two ways that we could know this. First is you could have memorized the solubility rules. This is a very basic list of the rules for solubility. If we go down the list, we can see that most carbonates, that's the CO3 ion, the carbonate ion, CO3 2 minus, they are insoluble with two big exceptions. One is group one on the periodic table. If those are bonded to this carbonate ion, they're usually soluble. And then if we have ammonium carbonate, that'll be soluble. But we're talking about calcium carbonate. Calcium's in group two on the periodic table. So based on these rules, calcium carbonate is insoluble in water. The other way is we can look at a table of solubility. So we'll look up calcium carbonate on our solubility table here. Teachers sometimes let you use this on a test, although knowing the solubility rules can make things go a lot faster. But let's look at the table. We find calcium right here, and as we go over, there's the carbonate, and we have that I there. That means that it's insoluble in water. If it's insoluble in water, it'll be a solid. It'll just fall to the bottom of the test tube or the beaker. Another way we could test this is just get some calcium carbonate, put it in water, see what happens. We would expect, based on the solubility rules and this chart here, it would be insoluble. It wouldn't dissolve. One last note, we could look at the solubility product for calcium carbonate, the KSP, because most things dissolve a little bit. Even if they're insoluble, they'll dissolve a little bit. The KSP gives us an idea of that. For calcium carbonate, that's 3.3 times 10 to the minus 9th, a pretty small number. So while some calcium carbonate will dissolve in water, it's such a small amount that we don't really consider it. We consider this to be insoluble. This is Dr. B with the solubility of CaCO3, and thanks for watching.